All right, looking ahead, you are encouraged to cool down at the Kern County Library with several events to look forward to as we head into those long, hot summer months. Of course, it's only spring, but it's already hot, so we have Farah Dredia here with the Kern County Library to talk about the free AC at the library, which I always love, but also talking about our summer reading program there. Yes, I'm so excited. This is my favorite time of the year. Um, <clears throat> the, the two months of summer, we're going to do the Summer Reading Challenge. It's our annual challenge that we do every year. So much fun. It's so much fun. And my daughter was using it on Beanstack mm -hmm. on that little app on my phone last year. Is that an easy way? Are there other ways to participate? Um, for me, that's the easiest way, but there are, are also paper logs available at all 22 of our locations um, where you can come in, just fill out the log and submit it, and we will do the rest for you. And that's so great. And I love that this is for all ages, but mm -hmm. really, I feel like the kids love this so much. My daughter's first year, she just did the 10 books, mm -hmm. and she loved it. Last year, she became almost obsessed with with the timer on the app, she was like, oh, it's it's only been 10 minutes. I should read some more. And I was like, sure, sounds great, honey. Yes, right? <laughs> have you seen that kind of response? Yes, most definitely. Um, I have a four-year-old now, and she loves logging things on Beanstack. So we yeah. use Beanstack all year round. And um, she just loves, she was like, did you put it on my Beanstack? Did you log it in my Beanstack? <laughs> so, you know. Um, it's such a great tool, um, but like I said, paper copies are also available. Yeah. If you like to put stickers on them, you can do that, all kinds of stuff. Yeah, it's just whatever is working best for yourself, for your kiddos. Mm -hmm. And then what happens when you finish the challenge? So when you finish the challenge, it's super easy, just 10 books or 10 hours. So if you're an adult and you know reading is kind of tough, but if you do audiobooks, just one audiobook, that's 10 hours or more, would okay. definitely cover that. Um, and you have two months to do it. Um, but it's super easy. Once you read the 10 books, you are guaranteed a book from our friends of the library. Um, but also, you can be entered to win um, local incentives for teens and adults. Oh. But children also get local incentives already. And we have some really nice ones lined up this summer. That's just so fantastic. So you fill out the paper or the log mm -hmm. and you stop by the library anytime in June or July. And then while you're also there, tell us about lunch at the library this so, year. Lunch at the library, I'm so excited. I've mentioned this before, but I just can't get over my excitement. All 22 locations are going to be summer lunch sites this year. And it's so exciting to help um, you know, the students kind of gather in a place, it's cool, it's nice, the food is good, yes. the atmosphere is great. You know, we've got programs during lunch, big performances, guest story, <laughs> yes. um, storytellers, all kinds of things. Um, but it's just such a great opportunity for all encompassing. Come spend your whole day at the library. It's just the absolute best. I love it. I was honored to read last year. I hope you'll have me back again. Of course. But my daughter sat down and had the lunch, and it was just such a treat and such a delight. And we want to spend three hours there mm -hmm. because there's so much to do. So thank you for all you do. Again, the Kern County Library hosting the Summer Reading Challenge and Lunch at the Library. And we'll have you back in a couple weeks to talk more about summer events. Definitely, definitely. Thank you, Farah.